Hi friends, welcome back. This is Amol Bhoyar and in this video we are going to learn about SAP SD sales document with schedule lines. In this video we will define schedule line category and also assign it. And after the assignment we will look on the different types of sales document. Now for that, I will have to go to the schedule lines, but before going to that, I will have to say something, I will have to discuss a table, here there are two types of tables available here, and one is category and its identification, why it is used, A stands for inquiry, B stands for quotation, C stands for order and D type stands for returns and in the next we will be dealing it with the inventories MRPs no no MRPs so T is for no inventory management X stands for no inventory management with issue goods issued and N stands for no material planning P stands for MRP V stands for consumption based planning. So T, X, N, P, V and A, B, C, D. These are the defined keys in SAP schedule line categories. Now we will define it. Define and new entries. And in the new entries, here I will write ZN and here I will give the name as no material planning and here availability I will click on the availability to save it yeah yeah my data has been saved now I have created material planning. Now after that I will assign schedule line categories. For assigning schedule line categories I require two to three entries. I will go to new entries. Here in the item category I will write on ADX and what ADX stands for you will see here. Is it ATR ADX that is quotation item? Then MRP type is ND that is no planning, and then here work sharing. Category here is BN. Now, what BN stands for? Sorry, BV is it BBN? It's BN. No MRP. Here it is. BP is for MRP, BN is for no MRP. I will save it. So this is how we can assign shell lines and also define schedule and categories in SAP. So this is it and now we will be dis discussing about the quotations, different types of uh, document types in SAP sales and distribution. So the types are documents, quotations, cash sales and rush orders then debit memo then credit memo what are the different types of uh, sales document types we will discuss that also 
so for quotations and docu documents the notations given here are sd document category is denoted by b sales document document category is denoted by b the letter b b for bombay then screen sequence group is declared by ag ag remember we first assign a category item category as ag while creating an item then transaction group is denoted by 2 and item category is agn and item category is denoted by agn now here we are in cash and sales document for cash and sales document the standard document type is bv for sales for cash sales then for rush order it is so and credit memo it is document type is g2 and item category is g2n remember document type is g2 and item category is g2n and same way for debit memo it is l2 and item category is l2n and standard order document for sales type is or standard is or so that's it in this lecture and we have completed our sap sg controlling with working with sap sg lecture have a nice day and hope you like this video please subscribe this channel for more free videos and helpful videos bye have a nice day